Kanye West says he's running for U.S. president. He need to go take his meds and get the hell out, get out of the way, man. I mean, here, 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 here's another guy that needs a hug. Big needs guy. a hug and a kick in the ass. Go sit your ass down and enjoy your wife, man, and your kids. Mm. I mean, I, 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 I've already checked into it. Ain't nothing he can do. He, 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 it's, it's too many states he don't even qualify for. It's too late, mm. in, too late in the race. But he needs some attention, okay? He, 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 and here again, you throw something out there, and it, it sounds uh, uh, magnificent. Oh, he's running for president. But could you? I mean, we're already dealing with one idiot, okay? Why would we even think about having another one? But people, I'm, I don't like either one of them. I would vote for Kanye. You a fool. Dude. I mean, and it's what we come to, man. We're voting. We're voting in um, uh, reality stars and rappers. This is bull. Well, I'll tell you, when I lost faith in the system is when we elected the damn Terminator as our governor. I was like, okay, this is this is silly. I'm done. That was I'm the done. first test. That mm -hmm. was, well, actually, truthfully, Ronald well, Reagan was a, Ronald Reagan was the first test. Okay, yeah. and we turned we turned politics from being a. Um, but from politics to being a popularity a popularity race, mm. okay? Everything changed after Ronald Reagan because now they want to see who's the most popular. Determined, oh, we could, oh, we could get another one. And they, they went in and kicked out uh, Gray and brought Arnold in. Mm -hmm. That's Remember right. That? Yep. They couldn't even win for the election. They had to yep. get rid of, uh, well, I know his last name was Gray, Gray Davis. Davis. Gray Davis. Yeah, Gray Davis. Yeah, they had to get rid of Gray Davis and bring Arnold in on a massive campaign because Great Davis was so boring and we got to Arnold, oh, come on, man. Again, it's all about the money. And he was screwing his, he was screwing his dog on uh, made the whole time. Come on, man. You saw that, you saw that son, right? Tell me that. Yeah, that's his son, okay? <laughs> that's definitely his son, okay? Man, come on, dude, so no matter, you know, here we go again. We got rid of Great Davis, who had no scandals, but he had no personality. Mm -hmm. Okay, they went in and they went in and had a special election to get rid of Gray Davis to put Arnold in office. <clears throat> Meanwhile, Arnold is screwing the housekeeper. Yep, got a baby by the housekeeper. Mm -hmm. He married to a Kennedy, but he got a baby by the housekeeper. And that housekeeper. What did, tell you? What did we just talk about that? That okay. did the good thing. The That's whole right there. Okay, you married to a Kennedy. You ain't gonna do with that. How keep hey, come here, sit down, you talk. Yeah, right. <laughs> <the> back, huh? <laughs> Looking like Ivan Drago and shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, yeah, no, nah, that's that's so true. <laughs> but um, yeah, um, now let, can he actually? Let's just say someone wants to write his name in. Yeah, I know he won't win officially, but isn't that technically taking votes away from? That's taking votes away from from uh, unless they vote, unless they want to vote for uh, for uh, for um, Trump. Mm -hmm. But in most cases, um, any vote not for Biden is a vote for Trump. Well, pretty much, yeah. We talked about that last time, exactly. Yeah. yeah. Any vote not for Biden is a vote for Trump. It's like not voting. It's basically just not voting. Right. All right, it's you're like, just throwing away votes. And you know, you got you got other you got rappers talking about hold your vote. Hold it for what? You got two choices. Left or right or back to stupid again. Okay, you got two choices. Left, right, or back to stupid. And it was even said at one point, well, uh if if uh Biden wins, we'll just have four years of uh, another another term of Obama. And <laughs> What's the problem with that? Okay, maybe we can bring some morality back to the White House. Maybe we can get some, remove some of the corruption from the Senate and the, the, the House. Come on, man, this is getting ridiculous, dude. They letting people go. Homeboy supposed to check in today. He got a pardon on Friday. Roger Stone, he's supposed to check in jail today. He got pardon today. He got Damn. pardon on Friday. This is, come on, man. They piss in your face and tell you it's raining. You, oh. oh, that's good rain. No, fool, that's piss. That's piss. Mm. They yep. piss in your face and tell you it's raining, and you go, and you done to get an umbrella. Hold your vote. I, I tell you right now, those, those white folks in middle America aren't holding their vote. They so ain't holding nothing, man. Oh, they man. come with it. See, and, and then you wonder, you wonder 
what the motivation is behind that. Why would you? Why would we even tell our people something like that? They, you know, they tell you, oh, your vote don't count. Then they, the same people. Some, well, some people say, well, I'm on the team, vote or die. Okay, that's Puffy. Then you got uh, a couple other artists. Oh, well, hold your vote. Hold it for what? And they, they're not going to get better. Mm -hmm. If you don't use it, it has no use. If you don't use it, it has no use. Yeah, it's like a, it's like a gift card that expires on November fourth. Right. If you don't right. use it, you gift card and you don't you don't use it for a year, they get to keep the money. Mm -hmm. So what are you holding it for? Yeah. I mean, this this is this is what happens when they stop teaching physics. I mean, uh, civics in school. Mm. This is what happens when they stop teaching teaching civics in school. Mm. People make stupid decisions, thinking they're being smart. Okay, well, what body going to give us? What is anybody giving us? Okay, what what we don't want is what we getting already. What we don't want is what we getting. That's what you don't. Want. That's what he's going to give us. He'll give us what we don't have right. What we got. What we getting right now. He'll, he won't give us what we getting right now. Okay, we got to do two things. We got to get rid of uh, uh, Agent Orange and get rid of Turtle Man in the, in the Senate. Mitch McConnell, he got to go. Mitch McConnell, okay. He's that's, that's a cold dude right there. He don't give a damn about nothing. If you ain't got six figures, seven figures, he ain't messing with you. Yep. If you ain't got seven figures plus, he ain't messing with you. And all of them is shady as all outdoors. It's shady as a dog on forest. Okay? Yeah. yeah. I, I, I think we should focus heavily, and if I can, ask our people out there, people of color especially, because this is something that we don't do. We really care more about the presidential election. We do our local elections. I really hope a lot of us focus more on our local elections as well, man. The mayors, the super, you know, and said those, those are things that d directly affect you. If you want your pothole fixed across the street, you got to, you know, you got to be involved in the local stuff, dude. not just. You know, one thing I can say about other races. Now, I've been, I've been to get in trouble because they go, oh, yes, I, I vote, yeah, some of us do. But mm -hmm. not enough of us do to make an impact. Mm -hmm. Okay? As soon as folks get their green card, they get their citizenship, they participate in the, in, in the system. Okay? Exactly. You look up you, in, in the areas that have people of different races, the police look like them. Okay? If you look in areas of different races, the city council looks like them. The, the, the vendors look like them, okay? We're the only ones that have one, one race patrolling the neighborhoods, another yep. race selling us everything, uh, another race running the city, another race running the county, and we just, and then we, but again, we either victors or victims. We either victors or victims, and you're gonna always be a victim if you ain't in control of your environment. Yep, yep. You're at the mercy of whoever's in charge, whoever patrols your area, whoever patrols your neighborhood, you'll be in, you'll be in, you'll be in, you'll be, in, you'll, you'll be victim of them. Whoever makes the laws in your city, you'll be a victim of them. Okay, because you don't control nothing. You don't, and and, and it's all, it's almost like man, like like back in the day, man. I'll, I ain't reading. I ain't gonna read, man. Read that. I ain't read nothing. Shit, man. What I wanna read for? Fool? Huh? And this is the same as why I wanna participate in the system. Then you wonder why the system beating the hell out your ass because you don't participate. Yeah. Politicians, under two, politicians understand two things votes and money. Mm -hmm. If you ain't got no money, you better get some votes. Mm -hmm. That's why when it comes to a city election, first person they go to is the block clubs. Mm. Ah, you go to all the block clubs. You want to be a city councilman, you got to go to the block clubs because they, rep they represent a couple of hundred, if not three, not four or five hundred votes. And if you can get to all the block clubs, you can get you enough votes to put somebody in office or make a difference. Or now you got something to hold your vote for. Yeah. Now you got a reason to hold your vote. If you are a city, you want for a city, uh, city office. And most city, um, most like city, Compton, for example, Compton have 110,000 people, but only maybe 10,000 vote. What the heck? Oh my God. You got out of 10, 110,000 people in Compton, maybe 10,000 will vote. Most elections in Compton are determined 
by between one to 500 votes. One election is usually determined between yeah. one to 500 votes. Mm. Okay? If so, that right there doesn't prove we need to vote, I don't know what does. So if you are, if you are, if you're in a small city and you get, and if, well, I know for sure in the, uh, in the, uh, district or in the city 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 councilors you can only vote people only can vote for city council in Compton from that particular council a particular area everybody votes for the mayor but if you're a city council member people in the fourth district can vote for you third district second district first district everybody votes for the mayor you might it might be I don't know 25,000 people in a district but maybe only 2,000 will vote out of 25,000. Mm. So if you got three people in the three or four people in the race, you know, you're, the, uh, the, it, the, the margins are small. And then when it comes mm. down to the, uh, the final election, it might be, man, it could be 200 votes to separate you from winning the dog on election. 200. Wow. And, and it all boils, a lot of it boils down to, because up until like 10 years ago, I was a very uneducated voter, but I still voted. And it all boils down to who, who has the most signs in the yards, because that's how I used to vote. I'm like, whose sign did I see most in the yard? That's who I'm voting for. I, I, that's how I voted up until probably like age 32. I'm going to keep it real. A, 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 um, a um, politician ain't nothing but a promoter. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Most of my buddies who are politicians were promoters back in the day. Ha, ah, that makes a lot of sense, man. Most of my buddies who were politicians were promoters. They were party promoters. They knew how to stay in your face. They knew how to, they knew how to get you out of the, out you, get you out of your house into the, into their venues. Same thing. They knew how to get you out of your house into the poll, into the polls. It's funny you said that because about five minutes ago, I was gonna ask you a question. I just let it slip, but I was gonna ask you, have you ever thought of running for for any type of office and the fact that you just said promoters or politicians it kind of just it was so funny how that all came together I've I could ask on a couple of occasions man I've been asked especially in Compton to run for uh, city council and uh, it was a running joke because I had a TV show in Compton for years yeah it was, a, it was a running joke that I would you know that's gonna be our next mayor that's gonna be our next mayor but I'm a real dude man I'm mm -hmm. a, uh, what, well I just I just heard this term I'm a millionaire okay <laughs> I'm a like, millionaire, okay? Money don't move me like that. I can't, you know, money just, I just, you know, and I, I know being a, being a politician, you know, people always want to figure out what, what's your thing, okay? What, you like money, you like drugs, you like power, you like influence. And most of the people that I know that are politicians, they love money. Mm -hmm. And, you know, it's always, it's always some way to get some money. And, I'm a I'm a real I'm a realist, and if I ain't surrounded by other realists, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be I'm gonna be the victim. Because if if, if I ain't got my hand out and you trying to put something in my pocket, okay, it's only a matter of time before you find something on me to get me out your way. I've seen it happen too many times, man. I've seen it happen too many times. I know I got partners, man. Most of my partners that were politicians found found, found, found caught a case some way form of fashion. Damn, dude. Most of my partners who were politicians who stood up, and some of them, they waited until they got them later on. And I mean, they, they did something. They, they may have been a, 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 hold a, a smaller office, wait till they got to the next level and she took them down before they got where they really wanted. Where they, they may have had their eye on something bigger. Say, oh, mm -hmm. no, he, he, when he get there, he, we can't control him. He got to go. That's, damn. He got to go. Damn. Ugh. It's a cold game, dude. Man, yeah. I, I, see, that's the part about me. I don't see you being in politics. Because I've been a promoter myself. And we, we, get, we got a bad rep, you know what I'm saying, as being janky and things like that. But you know what? I'm, I was always on the up and up. Most promoters on the up and up. When you're dealing with certain type of people, rappers and shit, you know what I'm saying, it, you got to act a certain way. And that's – we're just – we're bullying the bullies, you know, basically. And I, I basically I don't see you – I couldn't see being a politician because you don't have that janky side. Because I think to be a politician, you have to have a little janky. I'm too old to be janky, man. Yeah. You know, I, I got to shave this face every morning. 
I got to dye this beard every morning, okay? I got to look myself in the mirror every that's morning. How and that's something I like doing, and I don't like doing it after, and not be proud of what I'm seeing, man. I, I've done things in the past that made me feel shame, and like how it made me feel. And, and when you have to make decisions sometimes that um, are just for the money and not for the people, and, and I think that's, that's where we are in politics right now. Most of our politicians are just for the money and everything without a budget, it can't get done. I mean, we got potholes in Compton. Uh, one of my boys had a, had, 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 a, um, had a famous actor write him a check for 500000 Hey, man, we can get these potholes fixed. They told him he couldn't do it. Okay? He couldn't yeah. do it. Then they fixed a few of the potholes, then they ain't got no more money. Once the camera go off, ain't no more money. Okay? Mm -hmm. They fixed a few of the potholes, but once the, once the camera go off, they, they they out of money and they can't fix no more potholes. Damn, man. So my boy moved on to something else. Compton is the king of fucking potholes. I'm going to tell you right now. I drive through Compton. I need a fucking new uh, fucking tires every three months. Man, I, I, I have a, I have low profile tires on my uh, on my Cadillac. And I was going to see one of my buddies in Compton and he drives my Cadillac. And I had to just creep, man, just creep. <laughs> some beer bending my rims or something, you know, something like that, dude. Because you know, them potholes, you know, they had they had some, some memes on uh on potholes about copy that was hilarious. They had cars upside down, they had <laughs> the ground, they had the ground just opening up and swallowing in, you know, like one of them um Arnold Schwarzenegger movies where the ground just opened up and swallowed yeah. cars. I mean, it, 